corn might seem pretty simple. A big green stalk, some silky fibers, and hundreds of kernels tucked into a cob. But looks can be deceiving. Corn affects everything. It's, it's become a uh, major player in almost everything we do. The complexities of corn are being plumbed in a high security lab buried more than 160 feet below the surface of the earth. The reason for the security? Try to imagine a world without corn. If we had zero corn, we wouldn't have the livestock. We wouldn't have a basic staple in our diet. We would have problems feeding ourselves. To keep their experiments and the rest of the world safe, Controlled Farming Ventures put their research facility at the bottom of a sealed limestone cave. We designed our production system in response to a lot of the very valid concerns. Here, these scientists aren't just crossbreeding corn. They're literally building new kinds of corn, gene by gene. Geneticists and corn breeders are in a never-ending struggle to produce better lines. To do that, researchers first had to decode the corn genome. Corn has more than 50,000 different genes. To put that in perspective, you have just 26,000. Corn contains almost twice as much genetic information as people. Plants, like corn, don't have the ability to move away from stressful environments. So if it's hot or there's a drought, if we're hot or we're thirsty, we go walk in the shade and we get a drink. The plant has to have within it genetic programming to deal with whatever stress it faces. So it needs more genes. This genetic richness makes corn's DNA easy to modify. Much of the work done here involves traditional goals, like increasing yields and protecting this vital crop from biological dangers. Should there be a worldwide problem with corn, whether it's from disease or insect infestation, we can help the development of treatments for that condition. Corn scientists are pushing corn to be more than just a better plant. They're manipulating its individual genes to turn corn into a pharmaceutical factory. One day we hope to take what we've learned to develop a line of corn that's gonna be able to save lives.